uh, 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 university police? Yes. Okay, so basically a law enforcement person, doesn't have to be an officer, a law enforcement person says that someone looks suspicious, so that's automatically suspicious. She said that you were back here filming the license plates of all of the vehicles in the lot. That is okay. unusual. And how warrants further investigation into you, your motives, whether or not you are an affiliate of the campus, whether or not you are uh, interfering with the lawful business about campus. Mm -hmm. Figuring out what's going on. Mm -hmm. I don't. Uh, I don't see how that has anything to do with. Uh, you know, I mean, if I got a camera, it's obvious what I'm doing. <laughs> you know, this is definitely not a weapon. Okay. No one said it was. Right. So, taking pictures is suspicious. In a lot that you don't seem to have any lawful reason to be in, yes. Potentially. Mm. And how's that? I still haven't figured out how that's suspicious. Okay, because this is a closed lot and you don't seem to have any lawful business to be here. I don't see any gates. Okay. You know, most police departments that don't want people over there have gates up. Okay. Um, I also seen a sign over there, I could have sort of said lost and found. No, like I said, the lost and found is in a different building. However, the CSO office is open there for yeah. uh, bicycle registration, but you already said you're not here for bicycle registration. Well, if, if you're if you're going to open it to the public, you open it to everyone. You know, if I'm over here filming license plates or filming birds, it doesn't matter. I'm still filming. Mm. Okay. Do you have your ID with you, sir? No. No? Okay. Mm. What's your first name, sir? Our conversation's now over with. What is your plan for the rest of the day, sir? Um, our conversation is now over with. I'll invoke my Fifth Amendment rights. Hmm. Okay. Well, this isn't a criminal proceeding. And right. I'm not necessarily asking you to incriminate yourself. Well... I'm simply asking what your plan for the rest of the day is. Right, and I don't really want to discuss what my plans are. Because if I told you what my plans are, you would notify other people and it would ruin my plans. So... Well, sir, you don't seem to have any lawful reason for being on campus. Mm -hmm. Do you have actual business on campus? I'm doing my business. And what is that? Well, I may as well tell you now, I'm doing a First Amendment audit. A First Amendment audit? Yes. Okay. You've heard of auditors and cop watchers? I've heard of cop watchers. Yeah. Yes. Auditors are the same thing. Cop watchers will do audits, too. I was doing an audit to see uh, if you guys, uh, how, we would, how you guys would react with someone coming in with a camera and I just seen how you guys react with a person coming in with a camera. Well, sir, why don't we uh, step over here with my uh, partner and your friend real quick. Okay. That's my thought, man. Well, if ever you want to, I value your input. Um, I don't. I don't share exactly the same perspective. I think. Of course. I think that um, there's an explanation for a lot of different things, but there's always room for disagreement. And of if course. we want to sit down and we can talk about that, um, your your perceptions and or mm -hmm. perspectives, sure. I, I think it would be valuable for the both of us. So. I think so. I think so. Okay. It's all a matter of trying to find some kind of common ground. How you doing? <laughs> Up turn. We have. Uh, any other business that we need to attend to with these gentlemen? No, but I, I, I would just caution you real quick, not from my perspective as a police officer, but just, just recognize we are on university property, and if you don't happen to be student staff or faculty, mm -hmm. we could possibly get other calls. And if we do get other calls, we would have the authority to ask you to leave campus, and I don't want to see you do that. You're, okay, I got you. I'm, I'm okay with you guys being here today. Is that, do you have any issues over there? Do you talk to them?
Oh, we, we I just wanted you to be aware. Yeah. Um, that it could be a potential. Let's see if I right. understand. This it could a, be a potential uh, trespass issue if another at it, university staff. I don't know what the best way to liken it. Almost like an airport. Like you wouldn't want okay. people going around filming an airport, and this is sure. a quasi-governmental institution with laws that apply specifically to non-affiliated accidentally see yourself get in trouble and I don't want to see that happen for either of you. Mm -hmm. Just so putting it out front. We're not, this is not a normal like, situation city or community. It's, a, it's, it's, a little bit it's somewhere between private and public. Like you said, right. like, mm -hmm. like shopping malls is similar. Yeah, this way too. Um, maybe it's to fly a little sympathy for me because now I'm yeah. a big film. But, um, you know, the students uh, particularly, they pay a great deal amount of money to expect a certain service, yeah. but also that um, their, their peace isn't going to be disturbed, that they can go uninhibited through the community, I mean, tens of thousands of dollars a year. So they have a certain expectation, so we just want to make sure that we don't um, fringe on their rights mm -hmm. and maintain the peace on the community. Well, I think after this contact, I'm pretty much done here. But I have to, I have to reiterate that I appreciate uh, your comments on the Constitution and the respect of uh, civil rights in general, and I, I appreciate that. You know, I, I love hearing that from cops when I have the interaction. So thank you. Okay. Cool. Good. Oh, thank you. Uh, appreciate you, gentlemen. All right. This is my business card. Okay. You can share it with your. Robert. <laughs> love you. Don't mind. I'm Matt. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. And if you want to find my video where we had this conversation, it's Mike Blue Hair on YouTube. Mike Blue Hair. I, you know, I feel like because YouTube sometimes is good research. I think I've seen you before. I oh, think I do recognize you. Maybe my <laughs> stuff is. I have uh, videos with uh, a couple million views on them. Yeah, a few of them. So yeah, if you want to write that that down, you might be able to see my chat stuff. Oh, if you okay, write Mike, Mike Blue Hair on your card, gentlemen, I appreciate it. Yeah, man. Mm -hmm. that, that is an interesting logo you got there. Okay, I'll, <laughs> I'll just uh, keep that my thoughts to myself on that one. All right. All right. Well, thank you. Unless you have any questions. No, man, I'm good. All right. But do check out my channel because I, I I want you to see the the good interaction that that's of you on online because I think it's important. I gave your partner my business card. Okay. Yeah, we'll check it out later. <laughs> okay. See you around, guys. All right, gentlemen. Take care. All right.